The most beautiful places to visit in Croatia, Dubrovnik. The island of Muje. Korkula Island. The Kornadi Archipelago. Var Island. Makarska. The island of Brak. Sebenik. The Sebenik Archipelago, the islands of Zlarin and Pruvik. Kaka National Park. Plitvis Lakes. The small villages of Istria. And finally Pola and Ravinj. Dubrovnik is a city on the Adriatic Sea coast of Croatia. It is a historic city that is known for its beautiful old town, which is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The city is located in the region of Dalmatia, and it is a popular tourist destination because of its Mediterranean climate, stunning coastline, and rich history. Dubrovnik has a population of around 42,000 people and is an important cultural and economic center in the region. It is known for its cultural events, including the Dubrovnik Summer Festival, which is a series of cultural and artistic events that takes place in the city each year. Mulje is a small Croatian island located in the Adriatic Sea, off the coast of the Dubrovnik Neretva County. It is the most southerly and easterly of the larger Adriatic islands and is known for its dense forests and beautiful beaches. Mulje is a popular tourist destination because of its unspoiled natural beauty and its clear blue waters, which are ideal for swimming and snorkeling. The island is also home to Mulje National Park, which covers much of the island and is known for its saltwater lakes, dense forests, and diverse plant and animal life. Mulje has a population of around 1,600 people and is a peaceful and relaxing place to visit. Korkula is a Croatian island in the Adriatic Sea. It is located off the Dalmatian coast and is one of the larger islands in the Adriatic Sea. It has an area of 279 square kilometers and a population of around 17,000 people. The island is known for its medieval walls, cultural festivals, and beautiful beaches. The city of Korkula, located on the island, is the birthplace of the famous explorer Marco Polo. The island is a popular tourist destination and is known for its beautiful beaches, crystal clear waters, and charming old towns. The Kornadi Archipelago is a group of around 140 small islands located in the Adriatic Sea, off the coast of Croatia. The archipelago is located in the northern part of the Adriatic Sea and is part of the Croatian county of Sibenik Nin. The islands are known for their rugged, rocky terrain and crystal clear waters, and are a popular destination for boating, swimming, and diving. The Kornadi Archipelago is also home to a number of small fishing villages, and the islands are known for their fresh seafood. The Kornadi National Park, which was established in 1980, covers a large portion of the archipelago and is home to a variety of plant and animal species. Var is a Croatian island in the Adriatic Sea. It is the longest and sunniest island in the Adriatic, and is known for its mild Mediterranean climate and beautiful beaches. The island is located off the Dalmatian coast and is a popular tourist destination. The city of Var, located on the island, is a popular destination for its nightlife and cultural attractions. The island is also known for its lavender fields and olive groves, 
and produces a variety of wines and olive oils. Var is also home to several historical landmarks, including the Var Fortress, which dates back to the 13th century, and the Spanjola Fortress, which offers panoramic views of the island and the surrounding sea. Makarska is a city and port located on the Makarska Riviera, a section of the Croatian coast in the Adriatic Sea. It is located in the Dubrovnik Neretva county, in the southern part of Croatia. Makarska is known for its beautiful beaches and crystal clear waters, and is a popular tourist destination. The city is also known for its Mediterranean climate, with hot, dry summers and mild, rainy winters. Makarska is located at the foot of the Bayakovo mountain range, which offers a number of hiking and climbing opportunities. The city is also home to a number of cultural and historical landmarks, including the Church of St. Mark and the Makarska Franciscan Monastery. Brak is a Croatian island in the Adriatic Sea. It is the third largest island in the Adriatic, after Korkula and Bar. Brak is located off the Dalmatian coast and is known for its beautiful beaches, crystal clear waters, and charming old towns. The island is also home to the highest peak in the Adriatic, the Vidova Gora mountain, which offers panoramic views of the surrounding islands and the mainland. The island is a popular tourist destination and is known for its mild Mediterranean climate and sunny weather. The main town on the island is Supatar, which is located in the north and is a popular starting point for exploring the island. Brak is a Croatian island in the Adriatic Sea. It is the third largest island in the Adriatic, after Korkula and Var. Brak is located off the Dalmatian coast and is known for its beautiful beaches, crystal clear waters, and charming old towns. The island is also home to the highest peak in the Adriatic, the Vidova Gora mountain, which offers panoramic views of the surrounding islands and the mainland. The island is a popular tourist destination and is known for its mild Mediterranean climate and sunny weather. The main town on the island is Supatar, which is located in the north and is a popular starting point for exploring the island. The Sibenik Archipelago is a group of islands located in the Adriatic Sea, off the coast of Croatia. It is part of the county of Sibenik Nin, in the region of Dalmatia. The archipelago is made up of around 50 islands, islets, and rocks, and is known for its beautiful beaches and crystal clear waters. Zlaren is a small island located in the Sibenik Archipelago. It is known for its peaceful atmosphere and beautiful beaches, and is a popular destination for tourists seeking a quiet and relaxing holiday. The island is also home to a number of small villages, and is known for its production of coral, which is used in jewelry making. Pruvik is a small island located in the Sibenik Archipelago. It is known for its charming old towns, beautiful beaches, and crystal clear waters. The island is home to a number of small villages, and is a popular destination for tourists seeking a peaceful and relaxing holiday. It is also known for its production of olive oil and wine. Krka National Park is a national park located in Croatia, in the county of Sibenik Nin. It is named after the Krka River, which flows through the park. The park is known for its beautiful waterfalls and is a popular destination for tourists seeking to enjoy the great outdoors. The park is located in the Dinaric Alps, and is home to a variety of plant and animal species, including many species of birds. 
The park is also home to a number of historical and cultural landmarks, including the Kirka Monastery. Which was founded in the 13th century, visitors to Kirka National Park can enjoy a variety of activities, including hiking, swimming, and picnicking. The park also has a number of educational programs and exhibits, and is a popular destination for school groups and families. Zadar is a city located on the Adriatic Sea, in Croatia. It is the largest city in the county of Zadar, in the region of Dalmatia. The city has a population of around 75,000 people, Zadar is known for its rich history and cultural heritage. It is home to a number of historical landmarks, including the Roman Forum, the Church of St. Donatus, and the Sea Organ, a musical instrument played by the sea. The city is also home to a number of museums, galleries, and cultural events, making it a vibrant and lively city. Zadar is a popular tourist destination and is known for its beautiful beaches, crystal clear waters, and mild Mediterranean climate. The city is also a popular starting point for exploring the nearby islands, including Dugi Otak, Ugljan, and Pasman. Plitvis Lakes National Park is a national park located in Croatia, in the Lika region. It is known for its series of 16 beautiful terraced lakes, connected by a series of waterfalls. The park is home to a variety of plant and animal species, including many species of birds, and is a popular destination for tourists seeking to enjoy the great outdoors. The park is located in the Dinaric Alps, and is known for its beautiful forests and lush vegetation. Visitors to the park can enjoy a variety of activities, including hiking, swimming, and picnicking. The park also has a number of educational programs and exhibits, and is a popular destination for school groups and families. Plitvis Lakes National Park is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Croatia. It attracts over 1.5 million visitors each year. Istria is a peninsula located in the Adriatic Sea, in the northwest region of Croatia. It is known for its beautiful beaches, charming old towns, and rich cultural heritage. The region is home to a number of small villages, each with its own unique character and history. Pula is a city located in the Istria region of Croatia, on the Adriatic Sea. It is the largest city in Istria and has a population of around 60,000 people. Pula is known for its rich history and cultural heritage, and is home to a number of historical landmarks, including the Pula Arena, a Roman amphitheater that is still in use today. The city is also home to a number of museums, galleries, and cultural events, making it a vibrant and lively city. Ravinj is a city located on the western coast of the Istria Peninsula. In Croatia. It is a popular tourist destination and is known for its beautiful beaches, charming old houses, and narrow streets. The city is home to a number of cultural and historical landmarks, including the Church of St. Euphemia, which offers panoramic views of the city and the surrounding sea. Ravinj is also known for its seafood, olive oil, and wine, and is home to a number of restaurants, cafes, and markets. 